<laughs> you don't want to deal with it. Um, we joke because my son calls her white mom. Like, <laughs> she's more, she's more to me than words can even say. But I, I just have appreciated her influence and her impact on my life, and I will miss her. You talked a lot, Coach Kate, about you know having to step out a little bit. You saying this being a Division II program, it's not just I get to be a basketball. How do you feel like you'll adjust to that? Because you've kind of just been the basketball coach. Have I just been the basketball coach? <laughs> <laughs> um, in terms of the fundraising and all and those aspects of it, I think I've pretty much been hands on. So I think the biggest change will be the fact that I am the quote unquote face of the program, but I'm not nervous about the adjustment, even though maybe I should be. Um, to me, the biggest thing is that my seat is going to change where I sit on game day. I move over my seat. So <laughs> that and then probably the fact that I'm going to get blamed for the losses. <laughs> I should have to go with that, and I didn't. So now I have to take that. Hopefully there won't be too many losses, so it won't matter. But um, I think that's the biggest thing. But in terms of being the face of the program, and I'm not, I'm not concerned. I feel like she prepared me as best she could, and I'm ready for the challenge. I got a question. Uh, Amy Fool, Comcast Sportsnet. Uh, Coach, I'm just wondering, uh, you know, Kia said on a video that you saw recently that you get the first uh, 11 wins. That would obviously put you at the 500 mark. Was there any part of you wanting to stay to reach any of these milestones? Um, there really wasn't because it was never really about the wins and losses. I, I keep saying that. It was more about relationships with me. But he did say that on video that I could have the first 11. So I don't see why I can't come back and have a big group of another basketball, you know, for the office and uh, another trophy case. I'll take those 11 wins. Now that she said it on video, what Amy's alluding to is uh, Amy and my son, uh, her husband, uh, have been putting together a video since January. We started it and actually interviewing people in my office during games, unbeknownst to me until last night. I thought they got me a cat. They said, this is the best present I've ever seen. <laughs> For whatever reason, I thought it was a cat. And, uh, no, it was a video that we watched last night after we saw while celebrating our 35th wedding anniversary. And it was just amazing. They had people from 1987 all the way through to Megan Kerrigan. And uh, it was amazing. And, uh, but that is my, they, those are my 11 wins. I'll take them all. <laughs> <laughs>